Hey. Hey, wake up. Sleepyhead, come on. Come on, babes, you gotta wake up. Oh, I know it's comfy, but you still gotta get up. <laughs> come on. Don't make me tickle you. <laughs> so that's what woke you up, huh? All it took was for me to say, I'm gonna tickle you? Really? <laughs> so, uh, actually, you slept until noon. Y yeah, I, I was supposed to wake you up earlier, because I know you wanted to go on our uh, early morning patrol with us, but I, uh, I wanted you to sleep because, well, you were up late, and uh, I kind of felt bad. So I let you sleep in, so it's lunchtime now. Uh, and I was thinking, well, uh, me and my brothers were thinking, uh, we'll order a pizza and you can go get it, since you know you're uh, a human and, well, we're not. <laughs> yes, we can get two pieces of pizza, two boxes, because, uh, well, I'm pretty sure you're starving, because you didn't eat dinner, you kind of just did your thing and passed out. <laughs> Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, oh, uh, wait here. Uh, I'll go, uh, tell my brothers that we're gonna order pizza and, uh, I can take you there, at least. Okay, pizza's ordered and, uh, by the time we get there, it should be ready. Uh, come on, I'll take you there. Yeah, I'm sure. What kind of, what kind of boyfriend would I be if I didn't? Come on, let's just go. Hmm. So I think it's over here. Are you okay up there? Or, well, are you okay with me holding you like this? Getting a piggyback ride? <laughs> no, it's not a hindrance to me moving. Not at all. I can move just fine. I'm just more worried about you. You gotta hang on tight, though, because I don't want you to fall. Especially when I jump over the buildings. Oh, it's that one. Right, 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 right. I always forget. I always can't remember if it's this one or the other one down the road. Either way, they're both good. What did we order? Oh, right, I should probably tell you. So, we got uh, a pepperoni, which is just for you. And then there's another one with, uh, well, let's just say that it's like extra, extra cheesy. Like there's a bunch of cheese on it. And that's for, well, that's for the rest of us. Um, they're both larges too, by the way. Oh, here's the money. We all uh, pitched in so you could get it. Well, yeah. We weren't going to make you pay for it. It was our idea. Just take it. It's fine. <laughs> Please, just take it, babes. Take it. Okay. Uh, I'm going to drop you in the alleyway and then you can just go across the street and get it, okay? I don't want to be risk being seen. And not after last time. Uh, here you go. Uh, okay, I'll be waiting over here and then I can take you back. Oh. Man, they're so perfect. I can't believe I'm actually dating them. Who would have thought me, Michelangelo, would get the first girlfriend? The uh, partner. Uh, I'm not entirely sure what their pronouns are, actually. I, I just call them they. I call them they, and sometimes I switch between girlfriend, boyfriend. I'm not entirely sure what they want to be called. I'm kind of too shy to ask that. Uh, I probably should ask, though. It would be kind of bad if I didn't at least know. Uh, huh? Oh! How long have you been standing there? <laughs> I was talking to myself. Oh. Well... I know that you said you don't really care what you go by, since you're gender fluid, but I still want to know exactly what I can call you. Them and they? Or whatever I like. <laughs> I'll just stick to them and they. I'm sorry if I slip up and say girlfriend or boyfriend or something. I'm still kind of getting used to the... To this. I, of course, I've never had a partner at all, so it's kind of hard to, well, get used to something like this. 
Anyway, come on, let's get you home. We gotta eat. <laughs> We're home, and we got the pizza. So you all owe me a thanks, because... Ow! What was that for? Ah, you know what it was for. Shut up. Give me that pizza. Uh, Raph! Uh, don't be so rude. <sighs> Whatever. Uh, come on, we can eat the pepperoni in my room. They want a cheese. Extra cheesy. Uh, sorry about Raph being kind of, you know, rude, because I think he's still getting used to you being around. The others aren't. Leo and Donnie love you already, but Raph is a little... Well, he takes a little bit to get used to. Don't worry, it's not just a you thing. He... It took him a bit to get used to April and Casey, too. Well, maybe not so much with Casey, but with April especially. Maybe it's just a... Nah, it's not that. <laughs> well, no, he likes you. It just is a little weird. I mean, he shows me the same kind of love, except he doesn't hit you. And if he did, I, I would probably kill him. Well, not not, not actually kill him, but I, I, would, I would beat him up, because that's just... No one should touch you like that. No one. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, well, I can't help but get a little protective. I mean, what kind of boyfriend would I be if I didn't? Uh, so, oh, um, I'm gonna ask again because I'm, I kind of forgot. I know you're gender fluid, so I call you they them, right? Most of the time, unless you feel like being another gender or the other, right? Oh, good, good. Whew, I wasn't entirely sure if I got that right. Oh, yeah, they already know. It's just me who has a little trouble understanding. They already know. Even Raph. I'm kind of surprised. I'm not saying that he wouldn't respect that, but it just, I don't know, he kind of seems like the type of person who would just not care, but he does, and he respects that. He respects you, and that's how I know he likes you. At least a little bit. Uh, well, his first impressions. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not entirely sure what his first impressions of you were. I know Leo thought you were really brave for sticking up for yourself against those, uh, foot ninjas. And Donnie liked that, liked that, uh, you showed some strategy involved with what you did. I think that's what he said. Raph? Well, I didn't really ask him. But if I had to guess, it was because of the way you, well, the way you used your mouth. You know what I mean, you're, uh, talking a bunch of shit to them. Yeah, that's what I mean. Raph does that all the time. And I think he actually enjoys that. At least he could relate to someone who did that too. And me, <sighs> well, it was just you. I, I was starstruck by you. Not just because you were fighting, but just because, well, you're perfect, beautiful, handsome. I I don't know, you're just, you're perfect. And they all made fun of me for the longest time for that, too. Even after we've known you for a while, I just, they always teased me about, oh, you need to ask, you need to ask them out, you need to ask them out. And, I, of course, I was shy because, well, one, I'm not a human None in the slightest, obviously. And two, I just think you're too good for me. You know, I I sometimes think you deserve a human boyfriend and not a mutant because, well, I, I mean, I can't do things with you in the day. I can't take you to the arcade, the skate park, or any of the sort during the days. I, And if I do want to take you somewhere, it has to be at night and every place is closed. And if they're not, I can't take you there anyway because, well, I'm not a human. I know uh, you said that I that you don't care, but it's still is hard just to let that go. I mean, I can't help but think that you deserve a human boyfriend or a human partner. It's just what I think, and uh, I know, I know that. 
I know that you don't think the same, and I know that you do love me, but it's just a thought that I always have, and I wouldn't be the only one. If... Well, you know Donnie has a crush on April. Well, Donnie's the same way. I've talked about it with him, and he thinks the absolute same. He thinks that April would be happier with a human, regardless of what she would think. And of course, you know, he hasn't asked her out because, well, that's well, that's Donnie. And he's shy as well. But he knows that she needs a human because she wants to do things. And, well, Casey's there. At least friend-wise, I'm pretty sure, as far as I can tell. As far as we can tell. They haven't said anything, but... I guess you never know. A anyway, that's the whole point is, is that I'm gonna doubt myself when it comes to a relationship because I don't know what I'm doing. I'm winging it. I'm going based off movies I've seen or comic books I've read or, you know, of, or what even Donnie has said or what my brothers have told me. It's, I'm just going based off of that. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Not a clue. And I know that you don't care. And I know that you have experience with relationships. But I don't. And this is my first one. And it's a little scary to know that my first partner is a human. And I'm not. <sighs> alright, alright. I'll stop. I'm sorry. I got a little carried away there. But I just... I just can't help it but think that, and I probably always will. I know you tell me I shouldn't, but I can't help it. <laughs> I love you too, and I, I'm i glad that you love me for me and not caring if I'm not a human. That does make me feel better. More than you know, trust me. I'm also glad that you weren't afraid of me or my brothers when we first met you. You you thought we were awesome, you know? You you didn't care because why... I, I think I know what you said. You said this. Why would I care about what you look like when all that matters is who you are on the inside? And I think you also said it's New York. You're not surprised. <laughs> but the, the first part really touched me and my brothers, and, well, whether we don't say it, well, they don't say it, I do, but we do appreciate you. Uh, yeah, April was our first human friend, and then Casey, but it it's different with you. You didn't freak out, and they did, so it, you know, it just kind of took a little convincing, but you made us realize that maybe not all humans would freak out with us, and we thank you for that. I love you, but not as much as they do. Yeah, they like you. Like you way more, obviously. Uh, anyway, I'm gonna shut up now. <laughs> Let's eat this pizza and watch a movie. We can watch whatever you want. It's all about you today. Because you always make it about me, so I'm gonna return the favor. Okay, babes? <laughs>